greetings kids um, the box behind me as you can see is um, I gotta send a parcel off so grin and bear it right. what I want to tell you you won't probably most youtubers won't know what Aldi is um, it's a site that you can upload your media but it has one thing that YouTube hasn't Coco she's a woman who answers your fucking questions and your feedback YouTube does not they don't care about the little guy you know what I mean Coco does anyway I posted some videos well I'm a him fan as some people know and I posted him videos and my own him videos and DVD rips which I own I haven't sung them and I bought them in the shop and DVD um, and audio CDs and pictures what I scanned right. my beef is this <coughs> quite a while back on Aldi stands for live digital dot com I Coco contacted me well we were talking to each other and she bung up the idea of, you know because she took you know when you create a blog you on the font you got fonts that are installed on your computer you can use them well she took that function off as with many functions she's on about making the site better but she's making it crap she's making it dead I don't know why it co isn't called deaddigital.com anyway she contact um, we contacted each other and she brought up the idea of you know make a list of what I'd like to see on Aldi so I made a list Sorry, just having hot chocolate. I made a list of what I want, what I'd like to see actually. Um, the main ones were unlimited uploads or unlimited space, which I don't think will ever happen. And, you know, except for like blogs being posted on private or friends only. But, nothing I sent that no oh god what six five six months ago or even more I don't I can't remember and she didn't mention it she hasn't replied I know she replies to all my other mail it's just this list of problems with Aldi even though it's down every fucking five minutes it's like MySpace like there's no errors in live digital only a couple but MySpace got it fucking ones on errors and people aren't about buying it um, anyway I posted a lot of him videos and I reminded Coco all the time about the you know list and I could tell she's getting pissed off about it so, but I kept you know f asking her about it because we really need some help with the site and she ain't fucking helping even though I like her you know I love her as um I love her as a person because she answers every friggin email you know unlike YouTube that doesn't they say give feedback to us and they say on the site they answer and review everyone two years I've been on that site Count, um, about three profiles I still got them I must have sent over a hundred emails to YouTube not a fucking response nothing 
like a saved folder for instance like for your messages saved folder I've been on about that for two years nothing they will never respond anyway uh, the beef I got with Aldi and Coco I reminded her a couple of days ago about the list and she hasn't responded and that pissed me off again but instead of not answering instead of not answering she came up with all this copyright infringement bullshit As soon as people, as soon as record companies, CD companies, DVD companies sell you a DVD, whatever, you own it. We own it. We can do whatever the fuck we want with it. We cannot call it our, um, our written music. We can't say we written the music, we can't say we sung the songs, we can't say we had anything to do with making the song, the video, the whatever, because we haven't. That's the only thing we can't do. But everything we else, put it, and everything else, like putting it on the internet, putting it on the internet for others to download, uploading it to websites, should be legal and should be allowed. Cause we fucking own it. The only way, the only reason why they take the media down is because the government and the record company, the DVD company, haven't got a percentage. Like, if we upload a video to the site, right, we give them, you know. 50, 60 quid, then we can upload it. It's just because they haven't got fucking money off us to upload it. They reckon they're gods with it. The beef I've got with the government and all this shit, the government wants money from what we own. Because we bought it, we don't really own it, that what they're saying. We do own it. My wife gave me this shirt. I own it. What? You want me to give me money? You want me to give Leahy Clinic money for wearing it? Fuck you. Right. This is an issue that everyone hates. This copyright shit. Writing, blah, blah, blah. If you've got nothing to do with it, fine. We'd never say we hadn't every, anything to do with it. We just upload media that we own, that we bought in the shop for 15 quid or 1 quid, even if it's in a bargain bloody basket for 30 pence a quid CD. As soon as we buy it, as soon as we hand over money, we own it. If you don't want us to upload it because copyright. Why do you fucking sell it us in the first place, you cunts? Oh, God. I feel like taking a bloody Tommy gun to walking in the bloody Pentagon and or all the government offices and letting loose. You know what I mean? That is not a threat, that's just how I feel. So don't go pissing and moaning. Long story short, we own it. Hold on. The internet. If people want to upload what they own to the internet to, to, or to others to download, it shouldn't be illegal. They own it. They put it on the internet to share it with others, to share it with their friends, share it with other people to download. That should be legal. So stay the fuck out. Fuck you, good night.